The Byron Tigers and Lena Winslow Panthers have strung together two of the greatest football seasons in state line history, but they both needed to finish the job today in the state finals in normal. Scott Leber was on hand for all the action. One more win. That's what these two teams needed at Hancock Stadium at Illinois State University. Would we see a repeat of two years ago when both the Byron Tigers and Lee Wynn Panthers won state championships on the same day? The Panthers took the field first at 10 a.m. for the 1A title game. The Panthers were seeking the school's seventh state championship in football in the fifth in six years. They've never lost on the big stage. Their opponent was undefeated Camp Point Central, the same team Lena Winslow defeated last year in the championship game 30-8. The Panthers had their best shot at scoring on their first drive, but they were stopped on fourth down at the CPC 6. From that moment on, it was evident that this was a much better CPC team than last year's. The best player on the field was CPC junior All-State running back linebacker Elijah Gennenbacher. He broke off a 23-yard touchdown run with just under five minutes to go in the second quarter. That was the only score in the first half. The second half was a repeat of the first half. The Panthers still could not get the run game going. And Gennenbacher broke off another touchdown run, an 11-yard score with just under three minutes to play. For the first time in seven trips to state, Lena Winslow is not the better team. CPC won it 14 to nothing. All credit goes to them. They were extremely physical, extremely strong, extremely fast. They, they knew what we, what we were gonna do before we even did it. How hard is it to process what just happened out there? It's hard. Um, they're a great team, and we definitely gave it all we could give. But in the end, we came out in second. We don't get beat like that very often, but uh, that was the case today, and, and they were the better team, that's for sure. Yes, this loss will sting for a while, but what a run it's been for the Panthers and for the 16 seniors who reached the state finals three years in a row. You know, they, they kind of set the bar awful high for the next couple groups coming up, you know, and, um, but hopefully we can get things going again next year. And, um, but, yeah, this group of seniors, that was pretty special.